Hello everyone, my name is Wanyan Park. I'm a teaching assistant uh, for Opti 421 and 521, uh, introductory of the mechanical engineering. In this video, I would like to talk about dimensioning and tolerancing in mechanical drawing, especially so in solid works. Alright, uh, for example, I have a cylinder here, the 100 millimeter in diameter and 200 millimeter in height. I already made uh, its me mechanical drawing. Uh, let me open that drawing here. Uh, this is the top view of the cylinder and this is side view of the cylinder. Okay, uh, let me make dimension for this the circle and this height. Okay, click uh, this smart dimension button and click uh, this circle and also click this, uh, the, this edge for the height. Alright, now we specify two dimensions for that. Um, when you make uh, this the cylinder, uh, the, the real cylinder, you need, uh, you need to specify the tolerance because the people who make a real stuff in machine shop uh, needs the mechanical tolerance because um, the all mechanical machines uh, has limitation to make it so you have to specify that the the tolerance the precision of tolerance is higher um, make much higher cost okay so uh, when you if you want to make the simple things you don't need to specify any um, tolerances but if you want real really precise um, the component of your system you have to specify right uh, tolerance uh, I mean the limitation limitations okay now uh, let you know how to the tolerances for this two dimension uh, as an example once click this dimension uh, here is the options uh, on your left side okay here tolerance and precisions now when I click this drop down menu and here is the the options for the tolerances. Let me click bilateral. Okay, uh, for plus tolerance, uh, let me put the 0 0.001 and the minus tolerance is 0 0.002, like that. Okay, and see, um, you can see the tolerance is here, right? And also here, to click that, let me yeah, choose symmetry tolerances. For the symmetry tolerances, that only needs one box because the symmetry means the plus tolerance and minus tolerance is same. Okay, so let me uh, put yeah, for example, point zero one, uh, the two decimals. You have to change the the nominal dimensions uh, decimals like that. Okay, and this is for the decimal of uh, tolerances. This is same as nominal dimension 1. Alright, uh, click that. Um, now we, we, we know how to specify those uh, tolerances of this nominal dimensions. Okay, um, other than that, we uh, sometimes we have to specify some geometric tolerance. Uh, for example, uh, flatness, straightness, or circularity, something like that. Okay, so there is the button for that. Here, once click that, the new uh, windows pop something like that. Uh, let me see inside of this symbol. This is the straightness, and this is the flatness, and circularity, and cylindricity. Here is profile for line and surface parallel, perpendicular, angle, runs out, and here is position of a hole, and concentricity, and symmetry. Okay, let me click this straightness. Oh, yeah, straightness. And tolerance is going to be 0.2, whatever. And yeah, that's, that's all. That's, that's all. Okay, oh, here. This is the, um, the feature control frame. And I would like uh, the the pointing this uh, this straight line right um, click this one and let me uh, make a arrow and point 
making this edge. Okay, let me change type of uh, this arrow here, this one, and change the length of the flat area, the flat region. Okay, yeah, this is very simple. Okay, so uh, this straightness means uh, this straight line must lies between the parallel uh, two lines, the parting point two. Okay, so this gonna yeah, this have to make uh, as uh, follow this uh, to geometric tolerance. Um, well, sometimes you want to specify the multiple. Uh, geometry tolerances okay so if you want to do that just double click it and specify another uh, geometric tolerance like um, cylindricity and the tolerance is 0.5 no no, no this, this is quite big <laughs> to point, point 0.2 and uh, sometimes sometimes you want to specify uh, these things at maximum uh, material condition which is this one just click it okay and see uh, this change this uh, implement the depth symbol which is uh, as I mentioned the maximum uh, material condition and also you can specify list uh, maximum uh, list material condition for that right okay let's see click that oh let me put zero here right okay now this the multiple this is multiple geometric tolerances the feature control frame alrighty and I want to give another example for this circle okay click that and it may the, the circularity and tolerance is 0.2 like that click that oh here and make a uh, leader and move this point and pointing this circle and let me change the type of the leader like that or this okay all right okay that's all so easy okay um next i'll i would like to uh, provide another example um i have uh, the part two. This is a box, but uh, the one of corner was cut out, and there is a hole in and through this box. Okay, so I already make uh, its mechanical drawing. Um, this is the mechanical drawing. Okay, uh, let me make a dimension quickly using smart dimension. Let's see. Uh, we need this dimension. This dimension. And also um, this dimension right okay uh, I already uh, make the hidden line appears here uh, these two hidden line uh, represents uh, represent this hole and this one hidden line uh, is corresponded to this uh, cut out edge the corner okay uh, what else this whole location of oh. the location of this hole should be specified like that and also diameter and then um, this angle also have to be defined and it may need uh, this uh, the, the, the distance okay uh, let's see what I want to do is <coughs> I'm sorry <coughs> sorry uh, define datum surfaces using this button okay once click this button you can see uh, your mouse is change right oh, this character is D oh, um, I will change the character in a minute okay um, this surface, yeah, maybe the datum, and also this surface is second datum, and this surface can be uh, third datum. 
Okay, escape. All right, let me change this character here. A and this B and this C. Okay, here we can change the character of the datum datum symbol. Now uh, this angle, this, this surface uh, can be defined uh, with this datum. Okay, uh, let me try. The angle symbol is this one. Click that, and tolerance is 0.2, and datum. Here is the datum you can define. Okay, the, the primary datum is A. Okay, just click that. Um, here. <laughs> right. The click to make a leader and pointing the surface. Uh, let me change like that. All right, much better. Okay, so um, another thing is I want to specify the geometric tolerance of this the whole location. All right, I'll click this one, and the location of hole is the, the symbol of that geometric of tolerance is this one, the position. Okay, and then tolerance is 0.1. And primary is may A, secondary is B, or may the tertiary is C. And also <clears throat> here for this location, you can yeah define the material condition. This one, right? You see? And also datum can be defined as uh, the, with the, this symbol here. Once click that, there is MLS. So <clears throat> click, uh, OK, and click, OK, click, OK. Now, this long feature control frame here, and it needs the arrow, and we're going to point out this circle using uh, this feature control frame here. Okay, that's really, really easy to define, right? <clears throat> yeah, uh, the last example is the, the perpendicular tolerance. So, yeah, this, this line should uh, have some geometric tolerance as the perpendicular. Yeah, here, this, this symbol is perpendicular. And point 0.1, and data I'm going to, yeah, may... A and B like that yeah that's it and I want to move this one to and also this by like that okay the the head of arrow arrowhead gonna uh, arrowhead was disappeared automatically okay that's all all right. Um, actually, the the defining dimensions and tolerances, and also geometric tolerances, is really really easy uh, in SolidWorks. But um, you guys have to know what the symbol means. Okay. For example, here the strainness, the flatness, circularity, and the cylindricity. Yeah, whatever and runs out uh, the symmetry yeah you guys have to know what this means okay and also what this symbol means like for example the st means statistical uh, dimension okay uh, this all information uh, is in the, the the reference book which is the nc the white uh, 14 Point five M. Yeah, that book is really really good. You can find uh, those book in library or uh, in websites. Okay, that's it. Thank you very much.